Thank you for joining us. Our morning outlook will focus on the Euro dollar, recent developments and the potential impact on the markets. Let's hear from Greg in our trading room. The Euro dollar pair traded sideways in the last session. The ROC is giving a negative signal. The dollar yen pair plummeted 1.7% in the last session. The MACD is giving a negative signal. The gold dollar pair skyrocketed 1.5% in the last session. The ROC is giving a negative signal. Microsoft stock dropped 0.5% in the last session. The MACD is giving a negative signal. Thank you for sharing with us. Now let's hear from our news department. The Bank of Japan's move to raise interest rates to their highest in 15 years has jolted the yen to its strongest against the dollar since March and left it poised for further gains. Japan's Ministry of Finance spent $37 billion in the foreign exchange market to prop up their currency this month. The Nasdaq and the S&P 500 jumped around 2% as investors hoped for hints from the Federal Reserve on the timing of rate cuts. A bullish forecast from AMD boosted chip stocks and Microsoft slipped after a higher spending forecast. Eurozone inflation unexpectedly edged up in July, although a widely watched gauge of price growth in the services sector eased. Wednesday's figures did not seem to derail market expectations for an interest rate cut by the European Central Bank in September. Thank you. And now let's go through today's major economic events. Australia's trade balance will be released at 1.30 GMT, Japan's monetary base at 23.50 GMT, Australia's exports at 1.30 GMT. The US initial jobless claims will be released at 12.30 GMT, Japan's Japan Bank manufacturing PMI at 0.30 GMT, the Dutch retail sales at 4.30 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join our next review for the latest news and events from the financial markets.